guys, it's Nisi. And JB, what's going on with y'all? And we're back with another question for you guys. Yeah, I'm gonna ask it this time. Hold on, cause this one's funny. Hold on. All right. I think you asked the last one. Did I? Yeah, but it's okay. Oh. It's okay. <laughs> if I was to cheat on you, just one, just, babe, listen, just one time. Hit me out on it. Just one time, babe. If I was cheating you, just one time. Would you would you let it slide and work this out? No. That's the question. That's the question. If you was to cheat on your spouse one time, would you forgive them? Like, oh, if your spouse was to cheat on you one time, would you forgive them? So, I'm. A, do you want to go first? Or you want me to go first? Y'all should already know what my answer is. But I'm, I'm gonna let you guys know. For me, cheating is a deal breaker. So, one time is one too many for me. So, we're done after that one time. Because I told you, because I'm pretty sure if I'm in a relationship with you, I told you that cheating is a deal breaker for me. So, you you heard what I said, and you just disregarded what I said. So, no. You don't get another chance. We're done. This is a funny question, too. It, 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 we, it, it, it we run across a lot of funny questions. <laughs> My, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm with Nisi. This, yeah, no, hell no. I'm not gonna lie. I can even take a little bit of disrespect as far as like I'm not gonna get into it. But uh, uh, me and Nisi have been in a relationship a long, long time. We had ups and downs. That stuff Nisi did, I didn't like. That stuff I did, Nisi didn't like. But I tell you one thing. It wasn't no damn cheating going on on both sides. Because I'll tell you this right now. I can't do it. I'm fucking leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm, I'm I'm gone. Like. And if I and if you let's say you do it and you hide it, you gonna have to hide it for the rest of your life. I don't give a fuck if we 75. <laughs> we 75 grandkids everything our anniversary coming up if I find out you have been cheating I'm divorcing you at 75 years old <laughs> you sure will too and I'm taking you for everything you got you hear me I want it all if I can get it if I can get it I'm taking everything that's just me cause I'm not you're not gonna do that shit to me hell, hell no I don't give a damn now some of y'all is it's better than me? Uh, some of yeah, some of you guys may may if it's just one time. Some of you guys may be like, okay, I'm gonna give them another chance. Cause, and I'm gonna be honest with you. And this is just me. This is just me thinking out loud. If me if I cheat on Nisi <laughs> and she let it slide, I'm gonna do it again. It, it, I'm that's just, a good point. I'm just not, I'm just, this time, I'm just going to do it a lot smarter. I'm going to make sure that from now going on, she never catch me. I don't give a fuck if I got to lie all the time. And I hate lying. I don't know if y'all know. I hate lying and I'm not good at it. I'll, I'll practice lying every goddamn day to her just so she won't catch on. Now, it's hard to do because it's not in your nature, especially if you don't do it. But I'm just saying, like, if she was to do that, I w what would stop me from doing it again? That, and that's, the, and that's, that's my point I'm trying to get at. If somebody cheated on you, what's to stop them from doing it again if you took them back? Because if you allow cheating in a relationship, what won't you allow? That, that's how I look at it. If you let me cheat on you in a relationship, that's pretty much, I can do anything. There's pretty much nothing I can't do. Maybe the only thing I probably can't do is hit you. But if I get to have sex with other women, hit you for what? There's no point because I got other women on the side. Or like vice versa with she got other men on the side. Like, if you, man, this is, I don't, I don't, man, I don't think this is a good idea. I'm just going to be honest with y'all. If somebody cheat on y'all, I think y'all should just call it quits. That's my personal opinion. 
do what you want. Right. But I just just thinking like what I would do. Then that's what right. I would do. I would just try again. How Leah say? If at first you don't succeed, then you say, well, I'm going to try again. <laughs> oh, my God. That. You're a mess. I'll do that. I know. I know. I'm a mess. But, yeah, guys, you as you can see, this is something we talked about at, at the beginning of our relationship where we yeah, both was, discussed yeah. it. It was a deal breaker. Yeah. So that's why you that's so you can see how we both feel strongly about it. It's a it's a no for us. Now but I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. Go ahead. But like we said, you're grown, sure decisions to make. If you decide to anyway. be you know, if you decide to give them another chance, just I would say, okay, <laughs> just beware that it could be a possibility that they're gonna do it again. And you're going to have to become a damn Sherlock Holmes in your relationship. Right. And, and that, you, that's stressful. Right. And you're going to hate that. Like, having to go through their phones when they sleep, always saying where you going, can't even trust them to go get something, pick it up, bring it's it back. milk from the store. Right. Like, in the, like it's you're going to hate it. You're going to really hate it. And then they're going to flip it on you, be like, well, you suffocated me. You forgave me. for You can't forgive nobody for fucking cheating on you. I'm just being real with you. It, it don't happen. You can't forgive somebody for cheating on you. I don't give a fuck how much you say you're going to turn out a cheat, give it to God, push it, put it in the past. You're not going to forget that shit. Because every time they away from you, guess what you're going to think about? They cheating. It's going to be in the back of your mind. So, I don't, that's why for us, it was a deal breaker. There's, it's not going to work. Because I already think too much as it is, if y'all don't know me. Nisa can tell you, I think way too much. So, she cheated on me, and... Even she at work, I'm like, she's sucking somebody dead, dog. Like, un like in, the, in the room or in the break room. Like, she's doing something she ain't supposed to be doing. That's where my head gonna go. Why? Because it can happen just like that. And then come home and kiss you in the mouth. It can happen just like that. It can, because it does happen like that. So, if you know somebody cheating on you, and you decide to stay, you asking for this. And I think something that could go into it as well why people would decide to stay is because maybe they've been with that person for a long time mm, yeah. or maybe they really like they love that person and they, they don't want to let them go but I think about it like this whether you've been with that person for a long time or you just really love them and don't want to let them go sometimes in life we're going to have to make hard decisions do hard things, but if it's for the better of us, we should do them, no, no matter how hard they are. That's part of being an adult, honestly. That's part of it. No, yeah, it is, and, and obviously that's that's easier said than done, obviously. But you, I want to put it to you this way: if you had a significant other. And let's say y'all didn't work out, or let's say y'all got kids together, or let's say, again, y'all been together, y'all got to stay with each other for financial reasons. That sound good on paper. On paper, that shit sound good, especially when you present that to somebody. This is why I'm here, this is why I'm stuck. Do you know you can start your life over at any given moment, and there's nothing nobody can do? And I have to, And I'm telling you this. Because there's some people that watch this, that watch us, that need to hear this. You can start your life over at any given moment in your fucking life. Nobody can tell you otherwise, and it's never a wrong decision to do when you know you should. There's, not, there's no reason to start over and start from scratch and rebuild. It's okay. And here's another thing about this. If you've been in a relationship before, and you broke up with them... Whatever the case may be. You think you just automatically ugly now? You think ain't nobody else going to find you attractive? You think you just never going to experience love again? That's really what you think? Like, think about this shit. You really if you, think... If, yeah, if you had a significant other once, you won't have another one. Or like a, 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 a fling, whatever. You're going to have something. You, you think, just because if you leave this person... You never gonna 
experience love or pleasure, whatever the case again, you will. That's not the only person that found you attractive. That's just what you used to. What you used to ain't always good for you. Just point it out, though. That's a good point. But we don't, we don't, we don't topic. Y'all know we go, we, we, we. Hey, go hold on, hold on, no. This time we ain't going to talk. I think this, a little bit we did. No, this is therapy. <laughs> This was some good therapy for y'all. Some of y'all needed to hit it. Y'all need to take some notes. Probably replay this a little bit in slow motion. Cause I know you two got that feed. You can slow videos down. Y'all better slow down. Listen, what we saying now? These gems, I'm sweating. I'm like a pastor right now. I need my rag. Oh, <laughs> All right, guys. So I think that's all we had to say. Yeah, the answer is no. I'm not taking you back if you cheat on me. Sure not. I'm not doing it. Get this step in. <laughs> you and them kids can go. <laughs> Not the kids if they got some kids. It depends who side they on. They be like, all right, look, what y'all about to do? You want mommy or daddy? <laughs> you a bad. They gonna be like, what? I'm gonna be like, mommy or daddy? Pick one right now. I can't. I can't. I can't. What, what, what are they supposed to do? They gonna have to. They gonna have to choose either way. If I don't ask them, the judge don't ask them. Like somebody from the ask them. They got to go with somebody. All right, let let's end this video for real. He he summed it up for you guys. The answer is no. Or at least that's what we think. Again, do what you want. Yeah, do what you want, guys. But at least listen to what we just said. Yeah, think about those those points we brought up. Like at least just think like right, just think about it. Might really help you out in life. But that's all we got. Yeah. For this video. We'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah, we gone.